If you hit it in the chest, it'll be dead. You have to shoot right at its nose. There, it turned. Oh, hell, it left. Probably should take a shot. Yeah. There's a buck. The buck right behind it. I don't. I haven't seen nothing. They might be back out. Want to shoot? I'm gonna wait for it to try. I'm gonna wait for it to go so I can try to shoot in the window. Yeah. Go right on his nose. You gotta hit him. Go get many opportunities. Good habit. Reload. 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 Shoot again. Hurry up, because you're going to get away. <laughs> you got him. He's dead. What happened? <laughs> um, I, when I shot him. Rifle it, hit your head? Uh, I feel all dizzy. <laughs> I, think you, I think you got him laying out there, man. Let's go down and see. That was a hell of a shot. I don't know. I couldn't see nothing. Would have to hurt your eye? It hit me right here. Oh, it hit you, huh? You had your head too close. You got scoped. Just do what I did. Set it down and... It's easy. Toss it out. Probably the most equipment at Jay Scheidler at an elementary school is as high as this thing, and yet I would jump off that without hesitation. Well, that's a person that's a sturdy ladder there, it's solid wood. So, is this your first buck? Yes, I missed my buck last year because it was standing right there. Oh, too close, it was standing right rigging here. Well, how are you supposed to shoot that? It was right here. I shot right over here. I couldn't get I couldn't get it over here from the corner of the from the corner of the window. Well, that's a hard shot shooting straight down like that. But now I but now I got a buck. Hopefully. Hopefully we'll there. go check it out. All right. Let's get the uh, get the Gramp coming down the stairs here. I never have my phone on. That's good. She's going to get the truck, I guess. What's well, me and you walk down there? I wanted to put on when I got if I got something. Let's wait to make sure I don't I didn't ever see nothing. One of the reasons. Once we get down there, we're gonna
All right, so we're documenting this whole thing. So did it look like he was pretty big? I can tell it was very far. It's hard to see with the glasses of the scope. Or my opinion. It is. I gave her for my buck knife because I was too scared to take it down the ladder. Well, you did it. So the next time you do it, it'll be that much easier. Uh -huh. And what could possibly happen? You could probably fall like uh, 10 feet and you'd still be alive. Yeah, but then I have the knife there and that's just kind of messing with my head. We just worked on that ladder yesterday. When we got here, and we wanted to make sure it was extra safe for you. It was kind of getting weather beaten. There are turrets everywhere. All right, you go ahead and walk ahead, and I'm going to get some behind shots here. Okay. All right, about where was he when you shot? Oh, I see him. Hold on, right there. Just walk straight ahead. Hey, he's a pretty nice one. Look at that. Go give him a hug. Mm. Good job. That's a good shot. 250 yards with a small rifle. Now that is. Look, can do that. look how far away that is. Richie, look how far away we are. Get down there and hold him up so he can take your picture. I hit that from there. <laughs> That's 250 yards. I think I just used up my look for the entire century. No, that's skill, man. That's skill to be able to shoot that long of a shot. You got to be steady. You got to be uh, pull the trigger nice and easy. I'm going to quickly just pop that in there. Yeah, it's perfect here. Here, hold his head up. Get behind him and hold his head up. We'll take some video of that and then I'll take a picture. So just kneel down behind him on the ground. Do you want me to go up and get gloves to clean him? Nah. Okay, we'll, 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 we'll do it. So pick it up Let off me. the ground. Aim him toward me. Nice proud smile there. Look at that. How big is he? You got three points on each side? Yeah. Okay. Well, let me take a picture. Well, surprise your mom like that. I'll send her a text. That rifle is set for 250. Hold <laughs> a little higher and a little bigger, bigger of a smile. All right. Okay. I'm going to go get his mother and bring him. Okay. Now wait to clean him after we get here. I'll go get him. Can you take a picture? 
Do I need All right, here we go. One. Stand up, Bernie. One. Big smile. Look at that. First deer. Get out. So Mom, we can see him, Mom. Over to the side a little bit. Here we go. One, two, three. Look at that. Proud family. Now for the dramatic shot. <laughs> Ready? One, two. Hold the deer up better. I can't see it. Head up. Straight up. Get that knife out of your hand. Don't stab anybody. All right. Ready? This is the one. Good job. All right. We'll call that good. You want to take a picture with me? We're gonna, we're gonna move. Okay. I'm. I'm. Get him laying on his side first, kinda. Kind of roll him over a little bit. There you go. Awesome. And here. All right, you grab the horns, Daryl. Are we gonna keep it in there? Where's your button at? Can you go depot? Huh? All right, so. Is it on? I'm gonna start like this. Are you grab the horns? Now we're gonna get back about right here somewhere, and we're gonna go. One, two, here we go. And. <laughs> Is that on? There's a, there's a little red dot. Yep, a little red dot in the middle top. Yeah. All right, now the practice run. Let's uh, maybe try. Put him back. Grab him by the legs. Back down. Grab him by the legs. Okay, we want to get his back end to go in first, and the head to go in last. So grab by. The, I'd go by the knees. Get by the knees. More leverage. Here. Yep. Ready? Swing high. One. Two. Three. <laughs> <laughs> I don't think I can do this. Alright. Alright. Give me the head. Here, I'm going. I can uh, take a picture. I can do it myself actually. Now how we get. Make it nice purely. Richie? Alright, try this. Grab his tail. Get over there. Mm -hmm. Grab a leg. Oh, Grab it. Oh, I can't hold it. Let him out. Now, get this sticker on it. Ready? One, two, three, go! Yeah, I'm definitely going to get a wash up. Alright, you gotta call him in. Call him or get on the website. Yeah. How far is it to walk to the cabin? Yeah. Take him up there. We're gonna walk. He wants to walk back to the cabin. We're gonna walk. I don't wanna dirty up all I don't wanna dirty up the truck. You it's just your hands. Let him walk. Let's go. You exercise. want your coat? Get your coat. Well, once once you get it up, it's supposed to like catch up there, so it doesn't ah. release on you. Big yanks. Boing. Like a I think that's just about enough. One more pull. All right. Take her away. All right, go ahead and tie that, tie that rope onto that uh, little thing there, just in case. No. Wait, if that rope no. breaks, I found another one. The vine is pretty strong. It's strong enough to lift me. 
Will that hold it? Yeah, it's good enough. All right, Tarzan, let's see you climb that vine and swing to the next tree. Without getting a sliver. Or a spinal injury. Or a fractured skull. Oh, or a broken there leg. he is. He's off the ground. <laughs> That's Tarzan if I've ever <laughs> seen him. Got splinters? Do I need to <laughs> pull those out again? No. <laughs> what happened? Did it come loose? I stepped no, on it. snapped him oh. in the chest. It's, he stepped on it, whopped him. I'm proud of you, Richie. I didn't think you'd get one today. I thought maybe in the afternoon. He's the new in the new, new line of Feeney Hunters. Yeah. Very successful. Wait, Very steady shots. Greg, lift me up and see how, and I want to see how, how far I can swing on this. You want to fight me? Yeah. Greg. I need help. I need you to lift me up and help me up. You gotta use your own muscle, man. Climb it. Alright, easy. That's not tied up there very good. Yeah. But could, if it does break, then the branches. What if it broke and your face was over here next to this thing and you got scratched your face on yeah. this sharp thing? That would, would not be a good yeah. deal. Take a break for a little bit, or I, th I say take a break for a little bit. I don't like yeah, the cut of steaming good. deer. Wait, is it on video? Yep. Okay. Hello. Three, two, one, go! A full and functional swing. Fully functional. All you need is a strap, a wooden plank. Well, that's part of my way. And a branch. And maybe, maybe not. not. I mean, they, uh, they might not I'm sure the strap will. Body. But I know it supports my body. Brenda, can I give it a try? No. You might break it. I'm not taking the chance. This is more of a Brandon thing. Brennan thing, I mean. <laughs> Brennan. This is his fun. So what year is it? 2020, the coronavirus. Is that the whole year was coronavirus? Yeah. So if you watch this video in eight years, tell us about the coronavirus, young Brennan. Sure. Give us the whole story of how the whole thing happened and what it, how it has affected you. Um, the, the coronavirus has affected me and my friends and family. I can't, we can't touch, we can't touch each other. Now we have to wear masks at recess. Um, we have to sanitize, disinfect. I used to go, um, two, two times a week. Now I'm going five days a week. But we might go fully remote, which means we won't go to school. What's fully remote mean? That we don't get go to go to the building, and we basically have to do more work. At um, home on the computer, or yeah, home on the computer. That's no fun. Yes, yeah, it's, it's it just it's basically you doing way way more work. Because from the teacher's point of view, you have you have 24 hours at home every day. It's not like you have time to sleep. So Apparently. when you're at home at school, do you uh, ever get to like have a snack when nobody's looking? Well, there is lunch snack time. I mean, we, we haven't said... been full remote yet, but but I know some people that have had to do a full remote. That their parents just said fudge full remote, and they decide to take their kids to school because because I mean, compared to the amount of work they have to do at home to at school, Whee! it's obnoxious considering it. Really? I thought it would be easier no. at home. No. You're getting more work at home because because you're at home the whole day. They expect you to have the time. Wow. Yeah, so remote is just a big piece of a humongous chunk bigger than this whole world, actually this whole universe of poop. 
Now be keep it clean now. You're, you're, you're going to be watching this in eight years. Four motor Yep, he's right. It is a piece of crap. Piece of no crap. Filter. So do you think it's going to be over soon? Maybe, I Hopefully. hope so. We'll go back to the way it was before. Yeah, because one of my friends said, um, I mean, I don't care if I can get around easy right now. I don't care if the holes are going to be crowded. He, I just wanted to go back to the way it was. This is what he said. I mean, if I have paranoia it. sometimes because I have anxiety, paranoia. I mean, I don't get to see half the people I used to know. So basically, I'm wondering what's going on with, with half them because I can only contact very few people I actually know. Yeah, sure. and one of my friends said, watch Try it out, Rich. Watching the news. Mine. Watching Be the careful. News. Take it easy. Coronavirus did not exist. Do not give your full weight on there. Greg. Slow, slowly give it the weight. Oh, and by the slowly way. Slowly give it the weight. See what happens. Slowly, 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 slowly. Is it going to hold you? The strap going to work? The branch? Oh! I hear him cracking. Yeah. I don't think that'll work. Yeah, I don't think that'll work. Oh, yeah. by the way, Greg's behind the camera. See? What? What am I doing here? You're holding the camera. You're the cameraman. I'm the official cameraman this year. Um, and what, one of my friends said, watching the news. Coronavirus does not exist anymore. Five seconds later. Ah! Ah! Yes! Coronavirus! I hate you, coronavirus! Coronavirus doesn't exist! Yeah! Take off the mask and burn it! <laughs> <laughs> and thus ends our segment of Brennan Lee's story time. All right, we will ah! conclude this episode. Ah! Oh, with a wrestling match. Are you sure you want to try to do a wrestling match out here? I could pick him up and yeet him. We could throw him in that big pile of brush right there. Okay, Brendan, come here. I'm going to yeet you. No, wrestling! I'm going to yeet you. No! I'm going to yeet you. No! I am going to yeet you. <laughs> Oh no. no, it's all-star wrestling. You're going to throw him in the giant pile of brush. Let go of my earbud or I will throw you. Yeah. You're going in there with him. Earbuds and all. Oh, look at that. Down you go. That's big brother in action right there. 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Oh, out. it's a kick to the groin. Yeah. He didn't even hit me. Yes, I did. He all hit right. me in the leg. I got it. All right. End the video. We're calling that ending. Make it. <laughs> There's a lighter. The lighter's up one burner anyway. This burner. It's on. I want to use this one. Yeah. 
Get your, get that white hair, set it over there, see? Got its head down, and the dough, like a buckus. Didn't have horns, I didn't see any horns. No. You see a big buck, shoot it. I'll take it. It could be a little one. You get it? No. Did you get it on the camera? No. Shit, that's four. That's the most deer I've seen in one day out of here for years. Seen seven deer. Eight. Down the one around. We ain't spent no time in here. I can't even stay out the window. Yes, I heard it can't. Damn wind's blowing. I hate cold. I ain't even warm at all any time. I'm cold all the time. Poor circulation, I guess. My feet. Like now, my feet are swelled. Every evening, my feet are swelled. Got to take my shoes off. Put up my Finney license plates. I'll put one on the shed and one inside the cabin. Now I'll have one left over. All the kids has got one now. I gave one to Ted. He's got it on his garage. That was a small deer that went by there. Yeah. Like a fawn.
can't even see her. That grass facing me and I can't see her. I know where she's at. 